Right, so in this, this quick uh, video demonstration, this is how to use the uh, UV spectrophotometers, which are currently in the lab here at Salford. Uh, so I've just picked out this WPA uh, spectrophotometer. So after plugging it in and making sure that the power is on, um, to set it to wavelength, and which I'll just show you today, all you need to do is to look at applications on the screen and simply press number one for applications and to set it to single wavelength so we press one on this part uh, if we're happy with a wavelength of 450 we can keep 450 in place or so put 450 and then press the green button which represents OK so press green for OK and we set now towards a wavelength if we're unhappy with that we can go back with the red button back to single wavelength and change as appropriate so the C functionality the C button goes back and changes wavelength so we could go for 555 and then press OK again which is the green button and it will go up to 555 so we were happy with 450 so press 1 clear out and go back to yes 450 and again it's the green button and then what we need to collect is a blank so here we've got a cuvette which is filled with water already so you just may need to make sure that the cuvette is clean so clean it with some tissue paper and the cuvette is to go through this aperture here so you can see that the arrow indicates that the way that the clean side of the pipette should sit so making sure this is clean put in push firmly down and you need to press blue on the device and here for the clock or see the clock appear and here the sound is for it to set to towards zero take out the cuvette and for this one I've got some permanganate solution made up so we've got a fresh cuvette of permanganate and we will put down the concentration of permanganate into the cell and this time we need to press the green functional key on the UV to collect and we set up at a reading above 2.5 so this, this says to us that the permanganate is possibly too concentrated so you should obviously at that point dilute down so you can now uh, record that value this is above 2.5 you would be obviously your practical be given a concentration of solution to make up so once it's calibrated first with water in the first sense you're now ready to keep putting additional cuvettes of different concentration in as it says in your practical and keep pressing the green button you do not have to recalibrate the machine before every reading and that's your first simple instruction of how to use the UV spectrophotometer in lab 101 thank you